How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to close the Shell X, the Shell EXT loader. Um, and you'll probably get this error for a couple different reasons. Um, one, like right now I'm trying to install some apps from the Adobe Cloud and I'm getting the error um, Shell XT loader, please close this application. But um, if you go to your applications, you will not see anything there. What you actually have to do, and let me jump right into the tutorial here, is um, we're going to type in the uh, activity uh, monitor. And from there, in the filter, type in Shell. And you will get the Shell XT loader right there. So click on it and then click quit process and then hit force quit. Next, um, now another reason why you get this um, error right here is because you have to, if you use a program called SugarSync, you're going to have to close that program down um, because I think that program contains the Shell XT loader as well. So I'll type in SugarSync. I'll just type in sugar. And there's Trigger Sync Monitor. I'm going to click it, click Force, uh, give me Quit Process, and then hit Quit. And then it will close that program. Now I'm going to hit the X, and then I hit Retry. And give it a second. Hit Retry again. And that's it. Now it's allowing me to install this program now. So that's how you close the Shell XT loader. Um, Trigger Sync is the, only, is the main program I'm familiar with that. Uh, will prompt this um, little error or the message to close that. There may be other programs that use it, but um, for what I've read on online on some of the uh, the web forums, it's mainly Sugar Sync. So Activity Monitor, close out the Shell XT loader, and close out Sugar Sync, and you should be good. All right. Hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like the video if you did find it helpful. Subscribe to HG Tech Videos, and have a good one.